Hey everyone, it's Kathy with Plan Happy With Me. And if this is your first week here, welcome. Today I'm going to be working in my teacher planner that I use for All About Me. Um, it's not a teacher planner at all. Um, for the week of 1127. Now you're going to notice that my challenges are blank and that's because I'm filming really early so that I can be done for the rest of the year and just enjoy being with my family and friends. So I will add the challenges in the description below as I find them that match. Um, we're going to be, we're, normally I, um, would do an entire two page spread with you on camera. However, this spread takes quite a while to do. So in the interest of your time, my time and editing, I only do the left side with you and the right side is completely done and in the end I will show it to you. I've also already done the little header here. I really struggle with these and the problem for me is that I don't like the page without them. So I do those off camera because they do take a little bit longer to do. And you guys don't need to see all that. You know how to put that kind of sticker on, right? Or how to use it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add the date covers at the top. Now, um, when I, it's very easy to modify a teacher planner to a seven day planner. Um, and you just change the categories to dates like I'm doing here and then now you have seven uh, going across so then it becomes like a lined vertical right okay and then I you could use it just the way it is as a lined vertical um, but then you'd have to do something here and I actually cover this with my categories. So I've already put the category sticker on the box to save us a little bit of time. And there is a very faint dotted line right here that I try to line up my sticker so that it's somewhat, oopsie, square. Um, I do have a regular order here. So I, um, I don't, <laughs> what I'm trying to say is if, if I put them on out of order of the page, it's because um, I've already chosen the order that I want them to appear on the page. So I'm going to follow that order. Okay, and then we have self-care. And I have um, been working very diligently on... Um, getting these pages done in advance and so oh you know what I just realized I'm short sleep trackers I don't have them printed so I'm gonna have to put you on hold while I do that and then we'll come right back okay that looks good and this one now this is a teacher planner uh, kit sticker kit it is also now known as um, a Pentex, P-E-N-T-I-X um, sticker kit. And so uh, it's very easy to find them under either name, academic planner sticker kits, that kind of thing. You might find them as TPC Nation sticker kits. They're all almost always a two page sticker kit. So um, yeah. So we're just going to go ahead and put these on here. Um, I already have the other side done, so I kind of know how these are going to go. So we're going to put this one down here because it these are very similar in color. Yeah, they'll be across from each other, but if I did this, then they'd be next to each other. So we're just going to go ahead and apparently I needed a quote, so I already stuck it in. So I apologize about that. But I needed, um, I think I was thinking how do you best use it. And yeah, I see though that I am short a sticker. Oh, I think I know what it is. Okay, so we'll put this one here. And then I'm going to print my sleep trackers and I'll come right back. Don't go away. 
Okay, I'm back. I have printed a sheet of sleep trackers. Um, and we are going to cut them and make it so we can put them in our planner. I'm just going to cut one strip off here. And then that will make it easier to work with them. There we go. And I just cut them by hand. I have a Cricut. I am bound and determined to learn how to use it, but for this purpose, I really think just cutting them by hand would be just as good because I don't really want to, um, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't really want them to be separated pieces. I mean, that would be okay because then I could get them on the right line, but that would just be too much to put on each week and like I have said before the up and the sleep fits pretty good the bed doesn't sleep at all doesn't work at all um, but I'm hoping to fix that problem I have a about 10 days coming up that we're off over Thanksgiving break and I have a long schedule of things that I'm hoping to get done um, so that I can um, have all these little issues resolved in 2024. I'm just going to cut this other one. And um, you can see it's not a big deal to hand cut them. They are on a clear sticker. And um, that way I don't have to cut them perfectly. And they still work for me. Now if the kit has a package of three like checkoff lists some of the kits do I have decided rather than using my sleep trackers I will use my kit now those are done now we have to finish this deco box and I am going to use this and then I'm going to use some of these underneath the blue to make the blue look longer it's kind of silly but it uses what I have and yeah so we're gonna go ahead and put these on they're a little bit long but I'd rather have them all um, cut at the same time so that I get them the same let me see if I can lift this one swooshy here because um, I don't want to cut it Okay, so then we'll put the next one on. And then again, this is just how I can use up my stickers. This kit did not have a lot of deco boxes. And so I had to be very creative with what they gave me. And these are going crooked. Um, but this is kind of what I came up with for this particular week. Oops, that one didn't start off in the right place. Um, this was actually washi tape that I cut to make decorative boxes out of. So on the page it was a washi situation. Okay, so now we are going to use these really skinny header things. One more. And oops, it moved on me. Okay, now we're going to take a straight edge and a blade cut off that excess and put that one sticker back. This way they were all cut at the same length and that way I knew they would be okay next to each other. Okay, so that is that. And the printer just finished printing, so <laughs> if you hear that noise, you hear that as well. Okay, and then we'll put this one back. Alright, and then um, this is what I write on for my self-care or my goal for the day. I actually put it on the swishy or a box or whatever I use to put in there. And then, um, we're going to use those in a minute. Um, I use these little stars to remind me to put my steps in. So that's what the star means. If you haven't seen my after the pin, um, selection then um, try and check out one of those after the pin videos so you can see it all filled out 
um, it's just a reminder don't forget to write down the number of steps okay and then up here I'm going to use a dot as a checkoff box my 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 puppy is woofing which tells me he might bark soon so <laughs> Uh, we'll have to put you on pause if he starts that and then we're going to take these three boxes and these three boxes and we're going to put them in here so I know this one is red so we're going to put it here and this is my noted section this is where I keep track of four different things so let's see, let's put it, uh, I need a big green one. Um, and so I just use my kit, whatever they provide. If it is short, I will use Mojo's boxes to fill in whatever I need. Um, so there's my one, two, three, four things. Um, let's do a green one. Okay, oh, and then I'm going to have this one and this one, but that's just the way it's going to be. So we're going to put this color up here. Now this has a scallop on it. Might need a haircut, but I think this box will fit. So we'll find out here. Nope. So we got to give it a haircut. Really can't give this one a haircut. So hopefully the haircut on this one will be enough. And then we will be pretty much done with this spread. I'm trying to get these done quickly, ladies. I know that this time of year, you don't have a lot of time to um, watch videos. And so I'm trying to get my videos short and early so you guys can. Um, this one is done. And the only thing left on this one is the checkoffs, and I'm probably not going to keep those and these. And yes, that is it. And so now I will share with you the two-page spread, and you will be able to see what it looks like together. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please take a minute to hit subscribe or like, or maybe even say hi. You guys have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!